2017 is the 250th anniversary of the death of Telemann, uh, a composer we bring into our schedules quite a bit, um, and Nicholas has just done the Tafel music, the third set of Tafel music. Um, but we wanted to commemorate this incredible composer with one of his big works. And in fact, uh, the Day of Judgment is a piece with which we as a group have some history because my predecessor Tom Whitman uh, did it about 20 to 30 years ago and even recorded it. It's one of the very few recordings there are of it. And ever since I've been associated with Music of the Baroque, people have been saying to me, oh, do do that Telemann Oratorio again. So this is the time to do it, clearly. And um, I, I must say I'm thrilled to be doing it. It's, it's late Telemann, so uh, it really is a sort of in that bridge between the high Baroque and, and early classical. I mean, I, I hate putting labels on these things, but it is for, forward-looking as well as backward-looking. Um, and like many composers and their late works, Handel being one of them, Verdi spectacularly being another, we get this incredible burst of creative energy in his last years. And the imagination in this piece is just extraordinary. It's called the Day of Judgment. It's basically four cantatas, um, uh, each with its own sort of discreet little narrative. And there are characters uh, in each cantata, two of whom are recognizable, namely Jesus in part three and John the Baptist in part four. Um, and the others are sort of allegorical figures like disbelief or a mocker or um, a reverence. And uh, there are dialogues between uh, these characters and uh, the, the action is also commented upon or, or used by, of course, our wonderful chorus. It's a great piece for, for the chorus. They have lots to do. trumpets in a, an exhilarating way, he uses horns in a very surprising way, and the strings never stop. So it's very challenging for, for, for all of us, and uh, I'm, I simply can't wait. I think this is going to be a, um, I hope, a, a fitting celebration of the life of the great Telemann. <laughs>